ट्रेवलिंग इज द वन रेमेडी जो मुझे सेट से हैप्पी बनाते हैं एंड दिस टाइम चलो चलते स्कॉटलैंड ऑफ द ईस्ट शिलोंग So before proceeding with the video let me just share you my two step hair care that I have been currently following for the past few months. Well it is the Mama Earth almond shampoo with cold pressed almond and vitamin E and the almond conditioner with the same ingredient which is the cold pressed almond oil and vitamin E. As you all know that I love dyeing my hair with different colors with, with a lot of funky colors. Whenever I use them it really nourishes my hair scalp and it is also full of 100% natural ingredients. That's the reason why it really helps me keep my hair scalp healthy and also it always nourishes my hair. What I love about these two products is that it has cold pressed almond oil which is a rich source of vitamins. The almond oil smoothens hair and improves texture. And the second thing is vitamin E, which is an antioxidant that deeply nourishes the scalp, leading to healthy hair growth. Mama Earth is all about goodness, and every time you buy from them, they will link your order on the website to a tree that they plant. The exact geolocation. picture and species of the tree will be sent to you mama earth is all about goodness and it is plastic positive and mama earth has also launched their official app and users can now get early access to it and also get extra discounts and sales you can also use yatra 2022 for 20% discount on mama earth that's their official website mama earth is available on mama earth website amazon Nike and purple. Good morning from Shillong. Hi, we're getting ready. I I got a new shoe and I'm picking up my old shoe. And this is my sugar daddy. It's <laughs> a bit bloody with me ever since the morning. Your eye makeup looks so good. Is this your first time in Shillong, though? First time ever. I never thought that during this. Uh... Huh? So the first location that we are here is Mary Help of Cathedral of Christians and. Back of me there is a huge cathedral Roman Catholic church which is structured in a very gothic style and this place is located here in Limokra and yes let's all go in and see how this place looks like and let me take you well the cathedral of Mary help of Christians it is one of the most beautiful churches of Shillong one can visit this church to look at the various artwork depicting various chapters and scenes from the holy scriptures and the life stories of several saints and this church is located near the mosco square limukra so we are just entering the white leg now and then we had to pay 20 rupees each for the tickets and then for the camera charges we paid 50 rupees each my friend ningan and i we paid 50 each and yes here is Avika, hi. Wait, wait, wait. You're going so far. Ah. Yeah. What are you doing? You bought. And then Avika says that it's not a really nice place for single people, and he'll tell you why. Because you'll see couples everywhere, left, right, akhe gumao, three sixty, chupke chupke everywhere. So many couples enjoying their life. Har kono me tapat. These legs and grounds were met in. 191893-1894 by William Ward Casey Casey S S J Chief Commissioner of Assam. Looks like a chopper necklace. Chang. Alright, audience. Much long. Oh, I'm mixed up. Oh. Oh, you look so good. Uh, oh my uh, god so look at them wearing a classy traditional outfit attire just a video and this is Ningan hi Ningan Ningan hi hey, this is a dress from uh, video okay the what what is this uh, classy traditional attire uh, but this is more like royal uh, it's a royal dress sir mega rose yeah classy uh this is for uh, uh, uh,
coming to you And all I know it's been a long time I was on the sideline waiting for you We could go to California or anywhere you wanna As long as I'm with you I'm alright And we don't need the drama We find our own nirvana So run away with me tonight Cause it's been Uh, excuse me Food to come for rice Rice. Yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, oh. Chawal. Rice, chawal. Ah. Restaurant here. Restaurant. This is the car we rented this morning. It's just 2,000 rupees for uh, the whole day. But we have to put our own uh, petrol, of course. Hey, hey, hey. So we just stopped in a daba here. Yeah. And we are going to have. Hello. Hi. Come here, come here. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I like this place very much. <laughs> yeah, don't ask me to say it loud. <laughs> I like this place very much because it's sort of like village vibe. And this is the chicken tali. It's alu and carrot. There's some chutney. There's chicken. There's some uh, vegetables. There's rice dal. Everything in just one plate. Looks so good. Oh my god. Hundred. Oh, this is just 400 rupees. Wow, nice. Thank you. Ooh. Hi guys. We just reached Dalki. I'm coming here after like about three to four years now and honestly I'm a little disappointed given that it's not crystal clear anymore although the river is so beautiful yet it used to be crystal clear and the last time I came here it used to be like so beautiful and I could literally see all the stones down there but now that I don't know please correct me if I'm wrong I don't know if it's because of uh, overpopulation here and dirtying the river or is it because of something else or is it because it rains so heavily that it's not crystal clear anymore I'm not sure of the matter but whatever it is if it's something that we can have a solution to it then it'll be so nice if we can take care of the river nicely so that you know people from out of Nagaland out of out of Megale, out of Nagaland or out of anywhere or from anywhere across the globe can actually come here to see the crystal clear water well, we just reached the Shombindong village which is about 9 kilometers away from Daoki village. We actually came up here because the down there it was quite crowded and not just crowded but here the water is more crystal clear. The last time I came here a few years ago I also came here because this seems to be more crystal clear. Yeah, it's Umgot River. I'm, I'm not really 100% sure but I think it's Umgot River. And this Umgot River goes down the Shongbetong uh, village and also goes down up to Daoki village. And the Daoki village is the one which we saw earlier. Yeah. yeah. And we will do boating from there. Alright, let's go down. Side. Side. How do so much? It's very sweet. I'm gonna say hi. Huh? Where are you guys from? From Mokura. Mokura, uh, Megalaya? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, name? Yeah. Name, Hot name. Spring. Hot Spring. Uh, Frankie. Your name? Yalam. Yalam. Yalam Hot Spring. Mm, yeah, yeah. Uh, thank you. Yeah. See you. So this is the boat counter. How? So it's 500 rupees. Keta is in the game. Kuch chahiye to. कभी भी कुछ नहीं स्टॉप कर सकता है और आज भी मैं एक दूसरा जगह और नया जगह में एडवेंचर लिया था और ये एडवेंचर के लिए हम लोग ने सोचा कि हम सब लोकेशन ही पहुंचेगा बट थैंक्स टू गूगल मैप एंड थैंक्स टू गूगल रिव्यूज फॉर हेल्पिंग अस रीच दिस लोकेशन दिस माय सेकंड टाइम वोटिंग हियर एंड इट फील्स सो गुड ओके देखो नहीं हाय गाइस से हाय Hi. Farah, how is Megalaya so far? So earlier I mentioned that we're in Shunongbing village 
here in Hongkot River, no? But the real pronunciation is Shinong Prang Village in Hongkot River. Hongkot, <laughs> ah, Hongkot. Right now we are at Shinong Prang Village. Shinong Prang Village. So much water happening, guys. Also, yeah, you know, the most interesting part of this place is that this river, Umgot River, divides Chandia Hills between the Kasi Hills. This side, you can see on this left side of me, it's the Kasi Hills. And if we see this side, this is the West Chandia Hills. So this river divides. And once this river goes further, it will reach a uh, Dauki village as well. And from Dauki villages, uh, from the Dauki village, there's a river, and that divides between India and Bangladesh. Nah? So that side is Bangladesh, and this part is India. This is life. Kuch lok se ham milta hai or kuch lok se yare ban jate hai. We never know when is our last time together. Thank you so much for all the love shown towards my Shilong videos and always being so supportive everyone. And yes, extra bonny points for all those who have come to meet me in Shilong as well. Thank you everyone. Love you all.